here's your paper. Oh, uh, sorry, Chris, but I'm afraid I'm going to have to cancel my subscription. Cancel? But you love this paper. Listen, I think you're a real nice guy, but I've just decided to go with another paper. Hello there, Kyle. You look nice today. I see you're wearing your big shorts with the baggy leg holes that flutter so carelessly in the breeze. Here's your paper. What are you doing here? Be it, nerd. Thank you. Would you like to come inside for a cupcake and a glass of wine? Shut up, old man. Mmm. What's going on in my pants? Looks like we got six more weeks of winter. I'm wondering if I could borrow $17. Chris, what do you need money for? Isn't that why you have a paper route? No, this new kid named Kyle keeps stealing all my customers. Oh, that's terrible. You're a wonderful paper boy, Chris, and you need to remind your customers of that. She's right. You gotta stand up for yourself. Like my great grandfather, turn of the century, take on all comers, Griffin. All right, put him up, put him up. Are you having a bully day? I'm having a bully day. Is everyone having a bully day? Bully, bully, bully. yes, bully. Oh, thank God we live in this time. Hey, Mr. Herbert, I want you back. Please, will you be my paper customer again? Oh, uh, hey, Chris. Oh, is that my phone? Da -na 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 steal my customer away from me and i want him back oh yeah <laughs> <laughs> look grit the loser <laughs> i have that shirt at home mm -hmm. you you pushed me boys boys we can settle this like reasonable and sexy teenagers whoever can swallow the <laughs> most Tylenol pm wins oh my god chris what happened kyle beat me up you let that little punk beat you up? Peter, you should be more sympathetic. Remember, you had a bully too when you were his age. Yeah, you're right. Randy Fulcher used to pants me every chance he got. My book report is on the giving tree. <laughs> Nerd! <laughs> Randy! <laughs> Nerd! <laughs> Randy! One of us should go over and have a talk with Kyle's parents. I'll do it, Lois. Right after a healthy breakfast of juice, toast, and store brand imitation frosted flakes featuring Terry the Taggart. Their food. Hey there, are you uh, Kyle's parents? Yes, can we help you? Yeah, I'm Peter Griffin. Uh, listen, apparently your son got into a little scrape with my kid. Oh dear, they're not getting along. Like an old guy and a midget. Sir, will you please stop staring at me? Where's the rest of you? So listen, Chris is pretty upset about what happened. Would you mind if I had a word with your son? Not at all. He's up in his room. Hey there, Kyle. Hey, I'm Chris Griffin's father. Hey, I'm Chris Griffin's father. Well, that's not very nice. I don't sound like that at all. You're making me sound like Michael Stipe. Listen, I, I just want you to know what you did the other day was wrong. What you did the other day was wrong. You're not making this easy, Kyle. You're not making this easy, Kyle. My name's Peter Griffin. I'm a big, fat, dumb butt face. Shut up, Kyle. I'm Peter Griffin. I'm a dorky, fat, numb nuts. Kyle, I said shut up. You're a poop nose. <laughs> Something wrong? No, 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 no. Every, everything's everything's cool right now. Might be some problems later, but uh, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Hello, Peter did what? Well, I best be getting to work. It's nighttime. Boy, you said it. All right, take it easy. Lois, would that make you happy if I was never born? What? I'm going to prison, aren't I? Press charges if you apologize. Hello, Lois. Hello, Claire. We just came by because there's something Peter would like to say to Kyle. Go on. Sorry. Say it right, Peter. Oh, oh sorry. 
Thank you, Peter. Now, what do you say, Kyle? Apology accepted. Good. Now, why don't you patch things up with Mr. Griffin by showing him your Legos, hmm? You got Legos? Ah, sweet. Lois only buys me Mega Bloks. They're the same thing, Peter. You know what, Lois? They are not the same thing. And the sooner you get that through your thick skull, the sooner we can get this marriage back on track. Hey, listen, uh, sorry about beating you up. I felt pretty bad about it. Hey, this look like a spaceship to you? Sorta. Huh. Well, I never was very good at building things. Like that time I built that handmade electric razor? By gluing many razor blades to this ordinary desk fan, I'll...